Look, for me, the workforce of the future is actually going to be defined not so much by what they know. I think knowledge is important, but it's not the whole story. They're going to be really defined by what they can do. And that starts with their skills, with their aptitude, but also with their capacity to continue to learn. As they face innovation, they will need to continue to develop their skills. And so we need to have a workforce that will have the capacity to learn above everything else. I think they also need to be interculturally competent. The future is a global place and we cannot have a workforce that cannot operate in multiple global settings. And I think the intercultural competence will really be important in the future um, teams that will work on, on a number of problems. And that leads me to the third um, quality that I think the workforce should display. They should be creative problem solvers. They should be flexible and the challenge that they will face is no longer a dearth of information but rather a plethora of data. So the, the capacity for analytical skills, uh, perhaps a background in, in the STEM uh, discipline, really to try and, and hone up those skills that will enable them to live in a world that is both global and really full of data. Look, I think that for us to prepare the future generation, we have to let go of the way of the past. In the past, the universities were ready to deliver a fully formed graduate to the industry, and then the industry would either form or, or use the graduate for their own purpose. I think we have to adopt now a much more purposeful process of co-creation. And co-creation starts with the student, him or herself. It's very important that the student sees himself or herself not as a recipient of knowledge, but as an active participant in the education that they, that they will actually benefit from. Now, we also need that co-creation to extend to the university and the industry working in partnership so as to make sure that the, um, the education that the student acquires is one that is relevant and one that is going to deliver value to the industry stakeholder as well. So this doesn't end there. It's not a kind of sequential process. Our job is never done. We have to continue to work together with the student, with industry, with universities together, making sure that that workforce is not only um, ready when the students graduate, but can continues to be ready for whatever the challenge will be. Well, the University of Adelaide is incredibly excited and confident that we will have the opportunity to really implement that co-creation vision with Dassault. The 3D experience platform will give great benefit to our students because the graduates will all have the capacity to familiarize themselves with the tools that are really used by the industry leaders, you know, the, the companies like ASC and Boeing and Naval Group, etc. And of course for Dassault, it means working with us uh, on developing the workforce of the future, you know, a workforce that is ready for an agenda of change and innovation and technology and we're very excited about that.